Hey everybody, this is Chris from Friendly Moke America of Detroit, and today we're going over the tech specs on the Moke, kind of a deep dive on everything that makes it tick. We're starting at the front. Um, right here you can see that we do have the batteries exposed. The batteries themselves are warranted for 48 months or unlimited miles. Your charger as well is gonna be located on the driver's side underneath the front fender. Usually a charge will last anywhere from about 38 to 40 miles and it takes about six to eight hours to fully charge from empty to full. Now let's move on ahead towards the actual windshield and front end of the car. We'll go over a couple other things. Also mentioned that the charging port does use just a standard 110 outlet. So you can use this at any kind of outlet that you have at home. It's very easy, plug it right in, plug it into the outlet, six to eight hours, you're fully charged. All right guys, so from this view here, um, we can really showcase the wheels. So we're looking at 14 inch alloy wheels. Uh, these particular are painted in a matte black, uh, as well as uh, suspension on this vehicle is going to be coilover suspension on the front. Now for stopping power, you're looking at disc brakes on the front of the vehicle with drum brakes on the rear. The disc brakes are really gonna help slow that vehicle down um, in any kind of situation that you need to come to a stop quickly. Now they are equipped as well with windshield wipers, which is a beautiful thing, um, as well as washer fluid. So if you get some bugs on here when you're out cruising the beach or through the neighborhood, um, you can definitely clean those off. Uh, we have adjustable mirrors on either side as well, just for more visibility. Now let's head inside so I can go over a couple other things on the interior and then we'll head towards the back. Guys, in the interior, uh, what I really wanna start with is steering wheel control. So we do have headlights, um, we do have our normal brights as well, um, windshield wipers, uh, turn signals, that's all standard just like you'd see in your car. You do also have a horn as well. Beautiful, works perfectly. Um, the center display or your actual speedometer will showcase your battery charge um, as well as um, obviously your miles, how much voltage you have and what gear you're in. Um, radio controls are very simple as well. Um, and then you have your screen here for the backup camera. Now, we do have standard hazards as well as our running lights, um, headlight turning on and off if you're not using them um, at night. Um, and then a additional switch here that used to actually do nothing but now actually reduces the speed by five miles an hour. Um, so you can hit that to try to just drop down the max speed of the vehicle as well. Now let's head towards the back of the vehicle and I'll go over a few other things as well. All right guys, at the back of the vehicle, I'm gonna wrap everything up with just a few tech specs for the car. Obviously, we do have the spare back here with the rear view camera location. We do have our brake lights with our third brake light as well. Um, the length on the Moke is gonna be just shy of 13 feet. They also weigh roughly about 950 pounds. Now, the top speed on these is about 25 unless the um, button on the interior is pressed and then you're looking at about 20 miles an hour. If you guys are curious about more information, um, or want more detailed information, feel free to reach out to us at the link in the description or give us a call. If you want a more general walk around of the vehicle and what this particular one is equipped with, uh, take a look at our, our general walk around video that we have posted as well. Um, if you guys have any questions about ordering one, again, give us a shout. We'd be happy to help you out.